Hello everyone. Today we are grooming Tiny, and I know that he is very fitting to his name. Tiny is a St. Bernard and a Great Dane mix. He is a rescue that is currently available for adoption at Niagara Dog Rescue. He is currently staying in a kennel while he looks for his forever home. Today is what we assume to be his first bath, so hopefully he does well. All right, are you ready? You like treats, so hopefully you're a good boy. Here you go. Okay, good boy. We gotta be good for our bath, okay? I'm just trying to make friends with him. I want him to trust me because this dog does have a bite history. He was protecting his home. He was not just, you know, an aggressive dog on the street wanting to bite, but that tells me that when he gets scared or anxious, he might be aggressive. So, I don't know how he will behave, and I'm gonna try to take this slow. Something tells me I will not be getting him on a grooming table today. And boy, do you have some extremely long nails. Hopefully, I can clip them. Good boy. There you go, look. Yeah, good boy. Because he is staying in a kennel, boy, does he stink. So you really need this good bath. And hopefully it helps you to get adopted. Can I come in there with you? He has some stranger danger. So I am, of course, a stranger. But don't worry, him and I hung out for a little bit before this groom and I gave him so many treats that he must know me now as the treat giver and would not dare to execute me. Okay, okay, good boy, it's okay, it's okay. He was very scared about getting in the shower. I had to entice him in with treats, but he does know commands. So that is helpful when working on a nervous dog. As you notice, I'm not really bending down right now. That's just because I don't want my face to be in the line of fire in the event that he decides that he doesn't like this that much. He is wearing his collar just in case he breaks this noose because he is very large. I just want another way to grab him. Good boy. According to the rescue, he is a very friendly dog. Even the bite history that he did have, it wasn't an emergency room type bite. Although no bite is okay, it was just more of a warning, I think, rather than actually wanting to hurt someone. Good boy. Good boy, Tiny. You're gonna shake. Is the blow dryer gonna be a no-go? Hmm. You're very smelly. You're a very smelly guy. You're stinky. You stink like a kennel. Okay, good boy. Good boy. Tiny is house trained. He is crate trained. He is leash trained. He is good with other dogs. He's good with kids, but I would suggest older kids because he is a large rambunctious dog and he can probably knock over a toddler unintentionally. Okay, another canister of shampoo on the other side. So this is now three canisters, one nasty critter and two de-shedding. He so far has not shown me any signs of aggression, so I think he is good. He just needs some socialization when it comes to whatever home he's gonna be at, that there will be people that he doesn't know coming and going so that he knows it's nothing to be scared of. He is still a young dog. He is only about two years old, right? Good boy. Boy. Come here. Good boy. Good boy. Very good boy. It's all right. 
It's okay. Good boy. My guess is for blow drying, I will be following him around the room. Niagara Dog Rescue is mostly, I believe, a foster-based rescue. He is in a kennel, which means that they're paying for him to be in a kennel. Obviously, they're having a hard time finding a foster home for him. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. It's okay. Paying for a dog to be in a kennel long-term can be really expensive. If you guys want to donate towards Tiny's Care or towards any of the animals in Niagara Dog Rescue's care, you can check out the link in the description for Niagara Dog Rescue and leave a donation if you like. I'm sure the donation would be really grateful for it. It's okay, buddy. It's almost over. Thank you. Thank you so much. No, you can't jump on me. You can't jump on me. No, no. No, no. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. No, no, Tiny. You're all right. You're okay, Tiny. Okay, I think we are good. I am just giving this dog so many treats. <laughs> No more water. The dangerous water sprayer is done. I feel like I should try to dry you in there. Yeah. Okay, let's see if you'll wear a happy hoodie. Don't worry, I haven't left. Okay, bud, can you put this on? I'm gonna try drying him in here just because I have a feeling he is going to try and escape if I let him loose. There's just no way I'm gonna get him on the table. Yeah. Trying to get him in the tub, or sorry, in the shower was a chore. So let's see what happens when I turn the dryer on. Good boy! Good boy! Good boy! Yeah! Good boy, Tiny! really good at getting your head out of that noose. I'm going to give him a bit of a break from the dryer for a second and see what happens when I clip his nails. Good boy. Oh, you are a strong dog. Okay. Good boy. It's okay, it's okay. No, no, no. Good boy, good boy. How about the front ones? Hmm? Good boy, good boy. Good boy, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. 
Good boy. No, no, no. Good boy. Hey. Hey. They're really long. Hey. Shh. No. Okay. That's a bite. That was a bite. What if I, no, no. If I do them like this. I'm gonna let him down on the ground and finish drying him on the ground. Then I will attempt to do the nails on the other side, but probably with help because he is very stressed out and very strong. So we will be back once he is dry. I almost got all of the nails completed, but I had to stop because Tiny was going a little bit too ballistic for my liking and I was concerned about his safety and my safety. The cameraman tried helping me, but when he came in, he went to give Tiny a treat and Tiny would not take a treat from him and his entire body stiffened up. So that was a pretty good behavioral indication to me that he was not comfortable with the cameraman. As you guys could clearly see, he was taking treats from me nonstop. I don't have my other camera in here with me right now. It's just GoPro footage because I have a feeling this rambunctious dog is going to knock over my camera. So I'm gonna follow him around with the blow dryer to get him as much dry as I can because he doesn't really like it. And then give him a little bit of a brush out and he'll be done. While it was fun getting my cardio workout in, I'm hoping that you just stay here while I brush you now. Oh my gosh, I think I got all of your hair out with the dryer. That's amazing. You're barely shedding now. If I had taken this Equi Groomer to him when he first came in, I would have gotten so much hair off, but I honestly think I basically got it all out. That's pretty remarkable, buddy. There is honestly not a speck of hair coming off of him. Okay, he's done. I'm not even going to attempt shaving his paws because I think that would be a death sentence for me. Oh, you're a good boy. Yes, you're a good boy. You didn't like the cameraman. You didn't like him. Yeah, you're a very happy dog. I'm not gonna let him in the backyard because the backyard is a mud pit. It's like 10 degrees today in February. So yeah, it's pretty nasty. I'm not going to lie, I don't love cold weather, but I do like when the ground is frozen. Yeah. Now you smell like sugar cookies. He's eating some treats. He's honestly going insane right now. He's trying to jump all over me and slobber all over me. So I don't know if I'm gonna get any shots of him, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you're interested in Tiny, he is available at Niagara Dog Rescue. Again, the link is below. I think he will do great in a family that's willing to give him the time, energy, and training that he needs. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you again in a few days.